In the time it takes me to decide on breakfast, your computer travels through an entire tech timeline, from electricity to 3D games. Evolution in fast forward. When you press that power button, you're not just flipping a switch, you're starting a carefully choreographed boot sequence. First, the power supply unit converts wall electricity into stable DC power and sends the power good signal. Then the motherboard's clock generator creates timing signals, like a conductor's baton, keeping everything in sync. The CPU immediately jumps to a specific memory address where the BIOS, or UEFI, firmware lives. Think of it as the computer's basic instruction manual. This firmware runs the POST, Power On Self Test, checking if your RAM, graphics card, and other components are present and functional. It's like a roll call for your hardware soldiers. OK, hardware's checked, but how does it jump from beep, everything works, to loading Roblox? There's got to be more steps here. Now comes the bootloader, your computer's GPS system. It locates your operating system on the hard drive or SSD and loads it into RAM. Windows starts with the kernel, which is like the foreman of our digital construction site, managing memory, scheduling tasks, and coordinating hardware communication. The kernel loads device drivers, specialized translators that help your graphics card, sound card, and other components speak the same language as Windows. Then the desktop environment appears, background services start running, and finally, you can click that Roblox icon. When you do, Windows allocates memory for the game, the graphics driver translates Roblox's 3D commands into something your GPU understands, and the network stack connects you to Roblox servers. Your simple button press just orchestrated thousands of electrical signals, memory allocations, and network handshakes, all in under 30 seconds. So I press one button, and my computer performs more evolution than I do getting dressed. No wonder it boots faster than my morning routine. If you enjoyed this deep dive into your computer's startup sequence, follow for more breakdowns of the technology that powers your digital world. Next week, we're exploring what happens when you click send on a text message.